Hi, I'm Vinu Venugopal, a faculty member at IIIT Bangalore. So at IIITP, I head the Scalable Data Science and AI Lab, also known as CATS Lab. We will focus more on developing scalable solutions for various big data and AI applications. So today, I'm going to talk a bit about one of our recent projects called StreamSpan, which is an Indo-French project in collaborations with the University of Nantes. The project is funded under CSRP, or Collaborative Scientific Research Program of CEFIPRA. So CEFIPRA is a bilateral organization established by the Indian and French government to promote research collaborations between these countries. So coming back to StreamSpan, it's a three-year project where we aim to build a distributed stream data processing engine for spanning events. We'll get to what are these spanning events. So before that, a bit of a history. So back in 2020, we built one of the fastest data processing engines called AIR which can actually process high throughput point-time events with low latency, which means that if you have a large amount of data in the form of streaming events, we can process them in less time. And a point-time event here can be thought of as a unit of data with a single timestamp associated with it. So this is in contrast to the spanning events, where we have a time duration or a time interval associated with the data. A classical example of a spanning event is an event corresponding to a telephone call or a telephone conversation where we have a duration. So one of the key milestones of this project is to develop a progress tracking protocol. This essentially means knowing when to release the results of a windowed aggregation. So the base system which you are working on is AIR, which stands for Asynchronous Iterative Routing. This follows a masterless architecture, which means there is no master node guiding the slave nodes. And this makes our task even more challenging. But that's the best part about research, and that's what we are working towards. So from a data analytics perspective, processing of these kind of spanning events poses a lot of challenges, mainly because the conventional data processing systems like Apache Spark or Apache Flink, they are designed with point-time semantics in mind. So through StreamSpan project, we aim to develop generic system architecture for big data processing that treats Point-time event is a subset of a broader class of event called spanning events. My primary focus of work right now is establishing the essential benchmarks and baselines that are crucial for our project. And I'm also working on the adaptation of a very widely known streaming benchmark called the YSB, Yahoo Streaming Benchmark, so that it fits this uh, spanning events uh, setup which we have. This uh, will be very helpful in providing a foundation for us to understand whether the system is able to perform in a, a good way when it comes to a real-time data processing scenario. My PhD research is funded by StreamSpan project. Our French collaborators have made significant contribution to optimizing streaming data processing. However, they work have been focused on centralized systems. My research focuses on decentralizing their effort, adapting the optimizations to distributed environment. On a lighter note, we are not sure whether the existing optimizations are scalable to distributed environment. If they are in scalable, we may need to build a whole new approach entirely. This makes the whole work exciting and challenging and has a lot of potential for innovation. I hope this gave you a brief overview of the StreamSpan project and its various milestones and the possible impact of our research. In some sense, by this research, we aim to contribute to the theory of data stream systems and to empower developers with off-the-shelf robust and open source solutions for processing point time and spanning events seamlessly. Thank you for your time and interest.